Hello, this is Stefan from overunity.com. I just saw uh, that a friend posted the video from um, the German Bundesarchiv files here uh, regarding a magnet motor that I want to present now. I am just screen recording it now and make some English comments and translate it. So you can see <laughs> Already in the 1950s, we had a working a permanent magnet motor from an inventor called um, Friedrich Lühling. Uh, now I play that video here. Erfindern war der Umgang mit dem Magnetismus schon immer vertraut. Jene so he says, I will translate it. Um, inventors are. Um, known to play with magnets and yeah uh, and this is a video about a magnet motor for a car phenomenalen vermögen gewisser stoffe eisen anzuziehen doch wer bisher glaubte dass bereits sämtliche denkbaren anwendungsmöglichkeiten dieser naturerscheinung patentrechtlich geschützt seien Yeah, he said um, inventors know that that uh, magnets are known to attract um, Iron and <laughs> he just uh, uh, displayed uh, the guy uh, using some kind of magnetic boots to walk on such a uh, iron beam. And uh, now he shows here some um, uh, magnets for a, a chess uh, game. Okay, here. Yeah. These things here. Okay, let's go on. Hat sich geirrt. Der heute 52-jährige Maschinenbauer Friedrich Lühling aus Schleswig. Now this is the inventor, um, mechanist uh, Friedrich Lühling um, from Germany. Schleswig-Holstein. From Schleswig-Holstein. Die Voraussetzungen für. Uh, has already in 1970, uh, 1957. Um, invented already this motor this is now from probably 62 uh, that's the permanent magnet motor now he says he has um, made his invention so so good that it's time for usage in a car now he presents it in the UFA Wochenschau, that's uh, some kind of um, yeah, early 50s, 60s um, weekly uh, broadcast. Es ist mir entgegen aller herkömmlichen Kenntnisse über den Dauermagneten schon 1954 gelungen, Dauermagneten zu neutralisieren. He said, um, it's, uh, he has succeeded already in 1954 to neut neutralize um, permanent magnets uh, in their fields. Der rotierende Anker wird von dem Magnetsystem angezogen bis. This is the rotor which is attracted uh, by the system. Kurz vor dem Punkt, wo er ihn festhalten will. And uh, the rotor runs until the point to the sticky point. Im selben Augenblick setzt die Neutralisierung der Magneten ein. At this moment, uh, shortly before the sticky point, the neutralization of the magnet takes place, so the rotor can turn on. So dass der Anker ohne jegliche Rückzugskraft, ohne jeglichen Restmagnetismus so the rotor can move on without any um, yeah without any distraction without any uh, remanence uh, it just can move on because the magnets are neutra neutralized dieses neutralisieren geschieht bei dem laufenden versuchsmotor bei 290 umdrehungen uh, at this current motor, uh, this neutralization functions at 290 RPMs per minute, also revolutions per minute. 580 mal in der minute. So it's the no neutralization takes place 580 times per minute. So 
probably twice as much as the RPM. Ein Magnetmotor kann mit einem Satz Magneten ohne Unterbrechung 10 bis 20 Jahre laufen. So such a magnet motor can with one um, one stack of magnets run for 10 to 20 years without uh, needing any other input without uh, consuming any ener other energy. Die Möglichkeit der Ausnutzung eines Magnetmotors nicht auf allen Gebieten. So uh, the usage of such a magnet motor lies in all different kind of applications like here in cars nicht zuletzt auch als Autoantrieb so for cars without uh, annoying uh, motor noises und gesundheitsschädigende Auspuffgase and without any pollution of these uh, environmentally dangerous um, pollution gases from a normal Internal combustion engine. Und noch in diesem Jahre soll diese Versuchsmaschine einen PKW antreiben. And still in this year, I think it was broadcasted in 1966, it should uh, um, drive a car for a first test. Der Wert dieser Erfindung zeigt sich auch wohl in dem jahrelangen Bemühen anderer, die Sache einfrieren zu lassen bzw. sie zu sabotieren. The worth of this invention also shows in the case that it's he was uh, yeah they tried to to fight him to freeze his invention and not getting it to the market and trying to um, yeah to not let it get to the market. Okay. That it was, yeah. This only a short video. Maybe we can rewind again and uh, show uh, some more parts here. Um, so it seems he has some kind of special neutralization found. How to um, how to keep the rotor from sticking um Ding aus Schleswig-Holstein schuf bereits 1954 here Lüling motor type 4 times 4 motor number 3 um this is building year 1962 um, so this is probably built in 1962 and now uh, this video is from 1966. Die Voraussetzungen für den Dauermagnetmotor. Inzwischen glaubt er seine Erfindung so weit vervollkommnet zu haben, dass es ihm an der Zeit erscheint, so den neuen Motor in der Uferwochenschau zum ersten Mal this vorzustellen. This motor really works. That's a really shame that uh, so long they had a running magnet motor and we don't uh, have it today. <laughs> That's a real, real, das real shame. Entgegen aller herkömmlichen Kenntnisse über really den Dauermagneten von 1994. Ich habe versucht, einen Patent zu finden, aber ich habe nicht gelungen. Vielleicht kann jemand anderes versuchen, einen Patent auf diesem Motor zu finden. Und wir können sehen, wie es supposed to work. Er sagt, sie haben ihn sabotiert, um nicht diese Invention auf den Markt zu bringen. So they can still sell the gasoline fuel. Wow, what a shame. Well, I will try to see if I find some more um, uh, infos about this motor and um, yeah, and I will publish all the findings about it. And uh, so maybe some guys can try to replicate that. And yeah, it's a real shame that this invention uh, has not yet seen the light uh, and has not yet uh, come to the market. Okay, that's for now. Have a good time. This is Stefan signing out. Bye bye for now.